Hey everyone, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can change the name of your iPhone when you are sharing the internet network. That means that you have a personal hotspot, and I'm going to show you how to change the name of the network. So yeah, let's just get started with this right now. The reason you may want to do that is to have some like a funny name in case you also want to have your network to be recognized, in case you want to make it personal or it also fixes one huge problem. And I made a video specifically just about that, but I'm gonna mention it in the video as well. But I will talk about it later on in the video. Now, let me show you how you can change the name. Well, the thing is that you don't have any settings in the personal hotspot section when it comes to the name. And the only thing that appears is the iPhone's name. So you have to change the name of the entire device. And in order to do that, you have to go to the settings, of course, then go to the general and then to the about section. And the first thing at the top is the name of the device. And as you can see, it could be anything. Just name it whatever you want. Just tap it and you can delete it, type something in and save it as the name of your iPhone. But it doesn't stop there. It doesn't only change the name of the personal network that you would like to share with other devices and with other people. It also changes the name and the way your device appears on other devices in AirDrop. That means when somebody else wants to share something with you using AirDrop, they're going to see this name that you have chosen for your device. Sadly, these are just the settings for all things like you don't have it separate for some reason but yeah we have to go with that by the way guys if you're new on this channel make sure to subscribe so you don't miss future videos like these make sure to stay tuned for more content which is similar like this and yeah let's continue with the video let's continue with the problem that this actually fixes so a lot of people and myself included have the problem that if you would like to share the network from iPhone to a computer, for example, this is a common case and common way how people use it, then uh, it's kind of weird when it cannot connect to the iPhone. Like it can see the network, but when you click it, it doesn't do anything. It tries to connect, but it just fails every time. And merely changing the name of the network, that is changing the name of the iPhone and the way it appears on that computer, can make it work. Like I made a video about that and many people say that they did just that and really helped them. So it's really useful to know how you can change it. And if you ever find yourself in a situation where you want to connect to a network and you just can't, then try changing the name at least. It works with the connection of iPhone to uh, like a MacBook or computer, like uh, I mean Windows. So yeah, it can work in other instances as well. So keep that in mind, make sure that you try out this thing if it doesn't work for you. But for now, I would say that this is everything what I wanted to say in this video. In case you enjoyed it, in case you found it helpful, then make sure to leave a thumbs up. This does help the channel a lot. It helps us grow. It helps us become a community that is bigger and bigger every day. So yeah, make sure to do that. And yeah, we see each other in the next videos. Peace out, guys.